alternatives. And County, state, and local officials stood in solidarity to, to show their disappointment in the state's decision to eliminate the quarter city's transit way from its updated list of priorities. And they asked the project be reinstated. Montgomery County needs multimodal solutions. CCT is a crucial economic, for the economic growth of the Life Science Center corridor. And this is a great concern for all of us. The CCT has been on the books for 20 years. Originally, it was planned as a light rail from Shady Grove to Frederick. But in 2012, it was changed to a 15-mile bus rapid transit system ending in Clarksburg. Officials say the project is a critical link for economic development in the up county. We can't afford not to do this project. We still have land that is out there that is undeveloped, that is ripe for investment by key companies across this United States as well as globally. And if we are not committed to making sure that this quarter city transit way happens, we jeopardize the potential from those businesses coming here and investing in Montgomery County. The greatest indicator of an individual's ability to move up the economic ladder is that person's ability to access our transportation networks. And by leaving the up county high and dry as the governor has done, he is leaving hundreds of thousands of people out of the economic ladder. Last year, transportation officials transferred the project back to Montgomery County with 30% of the design complete. Without state help, Montgomery County would have to come up with more than $800 million that's estimated to finish the project. The state maintains it participates in projects that connect multiple jurisdictions, and they say the Corridor City's Transit Way serves just Montgomery County. So I would ask you, Mr. Governor, are you truly committed to economic development? Are you truly committed to the promise? Or are you more sold about selling Thrasher's French fries and funnel cakes on the Eastern Shore than you are about ensuring that Montgomery County and the state of Maryland becomes the hub for biotech in the United States? Reporting from much. Rockville, I'm Susan Kennedy.